And good morning people, welcome back to Persona 5 Royal. We are dead. Technically. Uh, because, well, Akechi killed us. And we have had our death certificate printed. So, officially, we are dead. We're not. And with that, we're going to be proving that at some point. However, Akechi is not the next target. Nah, we're going after his boss, Shido. Represent Representative Shido, the person going for the title of Prime Minister. And I think we need to find a way into his palace. We've got two keywords, his name, where he, uh, where his palace is, which is the diet building, but we don't know what he thinks it is. So until we find out that, and we spent a day yesterday trying to figure it out with no luck, we are stuck. We had a bit of a uh, decoration with the logo being above our sofa, so I spent the time to decorate everything else that I had here. I had the poster from Arn at Harajuku, the swan boat from Iway when we went to Inishida Park, the teacup from uh, Oya when we went to the sushi bar, and up there we've got all the mini uh, the mini prizes from the Queen games that I've gained. Other than that, same old room, it's home. Not much we can do though at the moment, we are stuck inside, we can't let too many people see us. So let's do something here and well, the best thing to do is just play a game. Things have been going a little against us. Let's calm down a little. A finished golfer. Okay. Now, let's see if I can get this. Hmm. That was terrible. Okay, that should do it. We got a birdie. Considering some of the other games that we've done, uh, dealt with there, that one's fairly easy. So if I can never get to Akihabara, I'll be able to turn this in for a uh, another trinket. Nice. Uh, only on the outside. Yeah, everything's in his favour right now. We need to swap that around. Hi there, Ty. Attack me. Yeah, um, we are fine. We're still alive. Yeah, we need to make sure she's 
not too worried about us. Hmm. Yeah, we've got Psy coming today, so hopefully we'll be a little bit more thoughtful about it. Keywords into the metaverse navigator. Boss, can you turn the TV on? Shido might be on it. Sure thing. Goro Akechi. Him and his stupid composed face. So, Akechi san, is it true you withdrew yourself from the media as part of your plan to capture the Phantom Thieves? I truly apologize for causing such a stir. Honestly, it required a lot of courage to openly oppose them when their popularity was at its peak. I mean, people often lashed out at me online and whatnot. Then was it also your plan when you said they weren't at fault after their popularity declined? That was to catch them off guard. I could say I applied my profiling knowledge. Once they lost public support, someone they thought was their greatest enemy lent a hand. That's the same strategy used in romance, wouldn't you agree? Why is he being treated as an ace detective of justice? It's not just on TV or online. Newspapers, magazines, I see his face everywhere. On the other hand, no one's hoping for our comeback on the fan site. Like, at all. Phantom thieves are evil. Shido and Akechi are just. It should be the other way around. They're manipulating information using the media. Leaving Akechi aside, we'll get back at him later. Our main issue is Shido. Were there any instances before when you didn't know the palace keywords? Well, there was the time with Futaba. We didn't know anything about her, so all we could do was make conjectures. Then why don't we just go directly and see Shido? That's impossible. He's surrounded by bodyguards and followers all the time. There's no way high school students can get an appointment with him either. Well, we do have an adult with us. No, that's still impossible. Besides, that's too dangerous a method. <sighs> well, this is a problem. It's with a ruckus outside. Isn't that an election campaign car? Oh, right! The candidates are currently campaigning! I apologize for the commotion. I am a Sayoshi Shido. Wait, did he just say Shido? Yeah, he did! Yep, seems like it's coming together. Man, talk about being lucky! <laughs> we can go check him out without an appointment now! Hey, Ryuji ran off toward the station. This way, hurry! And by the way, did something happen? You didn't seem well a moment ago. Yeah, we'll bring that back in a moment. Off to the station. Now is the time to rebuild this crumbling nation. Our government is littered with scandals, and criminals have taken a strong foothold in our society. Such a disgraceful past must be discarded. We must set sail into a new future of dreams and hope. Mm -hmm. So our children who can't. 
carry the burden of the next generation can be proud of their country. So our nation can once again become a powerful one with abundant wealth and luxury. So our beautiful home will be acknowledged as the best country in the world. Wait here. I'll go get intel for us. Wait! Hey! Yo, Shido-san! Stand back. I just want to talk to him for a sec. He's a busy man. The hell? Ain't he supposed to hear a citizen's comments? That's enough, brat. You're that asshole we met at the hotel before. At the elevators. Sorry, sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? What are you talking about? That moron! Come on, stop! But these guys... Hey, kid. You don't want to know what happens when you cross me. It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? This country is filled with clueless children. I worry for Japan's future. Let them go. My next appointment is coming up. <sighs> what a piece of shit. So what do you think after seeing him in person? Yeah, um, about him. Wait, he's the jerk you told us about before? The same guy! For real? Seriously? You're sure, aren't you? Shido's the one who ruined your life. Holy shit! I don't believe it! <sighs> Let's get going, okay? Shido's the guy who set you up? What kind of fate brought you two back together? <laughs> that is a very good question. Talk about a destined connection. Shido was involved in the cognitive research too, right? This can't be dismissed as just a coincidence. God, what the hell's going on here? Shido was already a politician then, yet he sued a student and ruined his future? He must have pulled some strings so that his name wouldn't be mentioned. Furthermore, he also would have had to force that woman into making a false statement. He would do anything. We're talking about a man who ordered a hit inside the police station. He can't sit still until he crushes whoever opposes him, no matter how trivial. He's always been that way. What a piece of shit. Children are the future, my ass! What he's saying and doing are completely different! But now that we've found out who did it, can't something be done about his record? Once the courts have made a judgment, overturning that decision will be difficult. It'd barely be possible even if proof of innocence is presented and Shido admits to his crimes. At any rate, we need to trigger a change of heart in him. Be that as it may, Shido's outer appearance and his true face are wholly different. It's beyond hypocritical. It's as if he's an entirely different person. He's 
speaks about the good of the country, it makes me wonder what really is on his mind. That man's full of ambition to rise in the world. He only thinks of the weak as stepping stools for his success. He treats himself as an elite man while looking down on others. Ugh, that's the worst. I assume the keyword for what he believes the Diet Building is will be despicable, too. It must be something self-centered and completely different from politics. Someone like him needs to be punished as soon as possible. Let's head to the Diet Building again right after school tomorrow. I feel we'll get it this time. <sighs> Stewing over it won't get anywhere. We have to do this. Okay, so we're wearing uniform tomorrow. Oh, hello, Iway. Um, I missed the second part of the uh, thing, but oh well, it's the second option. That's what I get for auto being on. Yeah, we'll be there. Again, we're sort of stuck in the Leblanc Cafe, not really surprised. And I've got to choose what to do. Hmm. I'm going to have a look around and see what's available. You know, I think there's actually nothing I need in Leblanc. SP wise, I'm good. SP skills, um, items wise, I'm good. Social stats I don't need, I'm max. You know what I think that I need the most? Life, actually. Nice. And not because uh, mine seems to be have taken away from me. What I mean is life, health for the palaces. Oh, you do so it? training might actually be the best idea. And since I've got all this protein, I might as well use it. Now, let's carry out our plan. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Five more HP with the extra one from the protein. All right. I'll take that. So we got Arn on the train this time. Last time it was Ryuji. No. No, they can't. That's what we are doing. We're not only doing a change of heart, we're doing a change of public opinion. Don't worry, everything is fine.
Nope. This is a reversal. <laughs> Maybe not, but sometimes you've got to cheat. <laughs> Are we going to give up now? <laughs> no. No, no, no. from yesterday go ah, shut up the real game starts at two outs enough chatting you should only be thinking about the keyword the citizens are secondary he only cares about his own well-being and that of his lackeys he wants to become prime minister even if it means trampling on others fortune rich people hey can you think of anything based on what you've heard from him? Just try saying anything. It doesn't matter if you guess. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouth and follow where I steer this country. Steer? Didn't he say something about setting sail as well on that... Uh sort of promotional tour of his must be a ship it was a match what the diet building's a ship what kind of scenery will that be the actual buildings on land i can't even begin to imagine what it will be like well whatever it is looks like there are no barriers oh sh shut up Let's hurry up and go in. Are we clear of the guard's sight? Get closer to the wall just in case. All right. Do it. Are we a threat? No. Did anything change? We went in, right? Security guards seem to be gone, but it's difficult to tell for certain. This seems to be similar to what happened with Sis's palace. But this time, the Dia building remains unchanged. Uh, the gate wasn't open earlier, though. Wait, look! Mona's appearance is different. That means we're definitely in a palace. Come on, let's go take a look. <laughs> How's it look over there? See anything? No, it's totally normal. I'll check it out. Huh? What the heck? What's up, Futaba? <laughs> Futaba? Hmm? What is it? <laughs> the hell? Huh? <sighs> um. Children can be proud of my ass. It's completely sunken in his head. If a guy like this stands above everyone, we're seriously done for. This is beyond ridiculous. The same goes for Akechi. 
He should have seen this scenery as well. Yet he still aided Shido. What in the world is he thinking? Whether it be for glory or for simply a reward, my father died because of someone like this. We gotta sink Shido instead of this country. A palace with not just the center of the distortion, but the entire country sunken. I can't believe there's someone with this tremendous of a desire. Be careful. This will be completely different from past palaces. We're definitely gonna take his treasure. Yep. Business as usual. Come on, what a lame way to start this off. No, I think that's how it should be. We haven't failed yet, so if we calmly give this our all, the results will surely follow. We must put an end to this by December 17th, the day before the elections. Let the infiltration begin. Time to pay him back for setting us up into a trap. I'll be very surprised if he does. He feels that the Phantom Thieves are not something he has to deal with now. First up, stats. We need um I actually don't know who we need, so let's go with Ryuji Yusuke and Haru for the moment. I know we haven't, we're not in the sort of dire situation sort of thing here. Because we're not seen as a threat yet, but... Let's be prepared to fight just in case. And Persona... Norn. Okay, so that's our return point is the front of the ship. Okay. Somewhere. Any... I don't think we've got any breakables out here. No. Okay, in we go. I wonder what he's going to look like. Um. Uh. No. Sort of like a Mardi Gras sort of thing, that everyone is anonymous, which means he doesn't care who they are. He just cares of, uh, of them as people he can use. That would be my assumption. I just hear a chest. I think there's a chest up top. Hmm. Yeah, there's a chest up there. 
And on the other side as well, okay. Oh well, let's go straight up. Oh, hello, it's one of you. The guard dog of Hades. Um, yeah, about you. I know your weakness. Because I've actually seen that one in the velvet room. So having Yusuke here is actually a good idea. Oh, is this a show of sorts? Mr. Shido never fails to keep his guests entertained. Indeed, those privileged enough to be on this ship are all on the winning team. <laughs> what is with these people? Why do they not feel any danger after what they just witnessed? It seems they think no harm will come to them because they're here on Shido's ship. They're not even sensing the danger. Come on, let's make him see what this ship really is. Yeah. Let's do that. Uh... Hey. There's a chest. Oh, hello. Let's open it. Show me a true form. We we we're getting into a lot of uh, fights here. That one's dangerous. The Strumming Vena Pelea and the Guard Dog of Hades. We should be able to start to. Uh, Yeah, we should be able to start working on gaining uh, things as uh, what's conf uh, no, personas now. No, we're going to guard that, and we're going to knock it down. Okay, irritable. Um, I believe that's serious answers. Let me get my guide up. Really should have had this up, up beforehand, but I wasn't expecting to actually do any uh, negotiating today. Uh, yes, yeah, serious answers doesn't like plague or kind. That shadow's no happy camper. Be serious and don't make light of stuff. Okay, there we go. Cerberus. 
Not ex exactly looking like any other Cerberus I've seen, but yeah, Cerberus. Black Hogatana, eh, it's okay. Uh, Persona, back to Norn. Morgana, can you heal Haru and Yusuke? Thirsty Demoness. If I remember correctly, this one doesn't have any weaknesses. So let's see if we can knock it down. Upbeat. So you like funny answers, you don't like serious or vague. Or you could just join me up straight up. Takini. Files. Ah, uh, okay then. I thought this was a door, uh, door when I was first coming up the stairs, but apparently not. It's just a wall fit, fit in. So let's go up the actual stairs. Gonna turn around. You are excellent. I'll reveal your true form. Self infatuated star. I have never seen you in before at all. You only have Dazzler though, so I'm not really too worried about... Actually, you do have physical attacks, so Dazzler and physical attacks is a technical. Um, yeah, let's go through the motions. Okay, so wind isn't the way, so it's likely going to be electric. Okay. Huh? Done already? How disappointing. Yeah. Oh, hello. I haven't been looking out for those. I really should have been. I think I need to go back down then. Okay, that wasn't what I was meant to happen. Oh well. Okay. Right. Yeah, and uh, let's try and not be uh, getting the jump on us. Might help quite a bit. I do need to go back down because I want to make sure I didn't forget anything down there. Don't 
doesn't look like it, so let okay, let's go back up. And since we're done here, we're continuing upwards. Ah, we've got a door, finally. So that fights out of the way, then I think there will be another one on, on this floor, but uh, now that I've got a good little first taste of this area, I think the team is going to be Makoto because there's things weak to a nuclear here. Yusuke for the ice and there will be things, at least the sound looks like there's going to be one for electric, so Ryuji seems a good idea. Are we going up there for something? It, there's a ring and there's... Huh. Okay, there is an item up there, or two. Okay, let's go up. Just a black rock. Okay, I was sort of expecting something a little bit more than that. But at least I'll pick them up. Okay, let's go through. We've got to come to a stopping point soon. Because, let's face it, this is our first time in there and we usually just get the scope of the land, the way our infiltration works and then we have the deadline. We haven't had the deadline yet. We know when it is, so we must get a stopping point at some point. So you believe it's going to be straight ahead? Do I want to... Okay, so we can't take any side doors yet. There is a safe room over here. Which we can't get to. Somewhere. I doubt I'll be allowed to do that. Representative's chamber. These huge doors are obviously suspicious. I wonder what's through here. There's slots to stick in something like a key card. Whoa, there's five of them. Four hundred seventy-five people in favor. Zero against. I hear something. Just there is no one against. Is that Shiro's voice? If this truly is the representative's chamber as written, beyond here must be the main assembly hall. The what now? It's that large conference room that's usually seen on the news. Oh, that thing! Gotcha! So, what are they doing inside? Most likely a meaningless vote. One in which whatever Shido proposes will always go unopposed. So he's doing whatever he wants by keeping only his supporters in there. What do we do to get in, though? 
Should we find these key cards? Maybe we need some kind of qualification. One that vows to be his follower or swear loyalty. So basically, we need to prove that we're on his side. Yeah, we really can't do that. I'm not up for it either. Still, we have to do this. But what's this qualification thing about? Why don't we ask the guests on this ship? That's not a bad idea. They don't see us as phantom thieves. They see us just as entertainers. That thought never crossed my mind. Asking around doesn't sound like a bad idea. The guests here are the cognitive versions of them in Shido's mind. They'll know any secrets he shared. True. You have a point. That said, the ruler here is that evil Shido. It wouldn't surprise me if they did turn hostile. Right. Yeah, wouldn't they attack us? We should prepare for the worst, of course. But I think we'll at least be able to talk to them. This ship is most likely an Ark loaded with those that Shido believes are worth keeping alive. It'd explain the luxury cruise ship. I doubt idiots who can't even hold a conversation would be here. We can at least gather information. It helps that everyone's wearing masks. We'll blend in even with our attire. We must believe that no one shows their true face to anyone else. Just like him. Well then, let's split up and ask around! Well then! Does this feel awfully short to you? We might be done... Oh wow, VIPs, VIPs. Is there a safe room nearby? It'd help if we can find one. Yes, and I'm going to take that little thing down there first. Hmm. So we're going to turn up there once we've gathered all the information. Gotcha. So high class and sort of VIPs. Um. How about you, Makoto? Found anything? Missed that. So, restaurant. Hmm. You know, I think we're going to be stealing uh, people's key cards. Um. Yeah, we're leaving that one for alone for the moment. Mostly because it's just the two of us. I don't think the uh, game would let us go up to it anyway, would it? How about we come back another time? Yeah. Joe 
Joker. Uh, yeah, I thought I saw the map as well, so... So we've got a bit of information, uh, sort of VIPs are the main ones and it feels like we're going to have to go and steal their keycards to get into the main chamber. Well. Yeah, so we're going to go over to the safe room. But I want to have a look at the map first because that looks odd. It looks like there's a safe room in the next part of the map as well. Wait, there's only two floors. Okay, no, there is there is more. Okay. Okay, so this the treasure is in the assembly hall. Right. Well let's head and discuss. Still, this is a surprise. All the cognitive guests in this palace seem like real humans. The casino earlier looked pretty real too. But talking with these guests was a whole nother story. You have that right. This ruler's observational skills and insight are off the charts. Shido's a formidable foe. Come on, no need to freak out. I'm not freaking out. I was just thinking it'll be easier to make a plan since they can talk normally. All right, let's put together the information we gathered. Huh. Gotcha. Could I have a letter of introduction from five VIPs? And those letters become the key cards. You're right. It seems. Influential poli uh, politician by the name of Owe. Owe. Seen at a, res a restaurant at night and sits at a table near the window. Um. A VIP who used to be nobility. Usually by the pool. Please hear me out. President of a television station. Play slots. Hey, listen. <laughs> President of an IT company. Always in his room and reportedly enters from an exclusive hallway. Listen up. And the cleaner. Yeah, I've got most of them in my head. Really? Wow! We're up against five people. The politician Owe, a former noble, a TV station president, an IT company president, and a cleaner. We get certification from them and obtain letters of introduction that'll serve as key cards, but only go for the cleaner after the other four have been dealt with, right? 
Whoa, now that's impressive. You go, genius. If we can't remember the details on the VIPs, let's reconvene inside a safe room. All right, let's get this done quickly. Hey. Yeah, powerful individuals. If they've got a powerful cognition, they might be. They might end up being powerful foes. Well. Plus, that stopping point seems. It seems to be here. However, we do have a. Uh, We do have the velvet room already so next time we leave and we'll figure out where we're going next i honestly don't know when we're coming back because i've not played any further than this i do know what we're going to be doing at some point soon if we get the chance but when we're coming back to the palace i do not know we'll find out when i get there so until next time, have a wonderful day, have lots of fun, goodbye.